Okay guys, so I'm making a quick video here on how to make a really uh, inexpensive 5 inch alien clone FPV system. And this is for someone uh, that is a beginner that hasn't bought anything, so this will include a radio and goggles and uh, pretty much everything to get him flying. And we're going to start with the Martian 2 220mm uh, 5 inch frame. This is a, a pretty good replica of the uh, alien uh, 5 inch alien frame. That's what it looks like. I'll have links to all the stuff in the description if uh, you guys are wondering. The next component I would select would be these uh, King Kong 2205-2300 kV motors. They're rated to 2-4S to and they're $8 each. And then I would get these uh, 20 amp ESCs from Oversky. Uh, the MR20 amps eight dollars each and uh, these are basically like little bee clones uh, they come with the SI Labs F330 chip on them the flight controller that I would get would be this Lux clone uh, it's $25 it's a so basically a, a, a clone of the Luminar Lux flight controller it has an F3 processor in it this is the battery I'd get it's a 4S 1300 milliamp, 70C, you know, it's a graphene based battery. Uh, here's a, a basic 700 TV line uh, CMOS camera, and uh, it's got the, it's the sort of the, the clone case of the HS1177, so it'll fit into that frame very nicely. I would get this uh, 250 milliwatt video transmitter, it's got uh, 40 channels in race band, and it includes a circular polarized antenna. These are the props I'd get. They're uh, 545 version 2 from Dalprop, uh, Bonos. And this is the radio I would get. It's a Flysky i6, and it includes a uh, the IA6B receiver. And it's important to get this one because the, the A6 without the B does not do PPM, whereas this one does PPM, and uh, the Lux flight controller does not do PWM. So you have to get this one. The uh, goggles I'd get are the uh, Eoshin EV800s. They're 5 inches, and uh, the, uh, this is what I have, and they're pretty nice. I did a review on them on my channel uh, about a couple weeks ago. $80 for that. So here's my whole cart. And the total comes out to $295.67. So let me know if anyone can beat that for the, the quality of components that we've got here.